Honestly, I may as well adopt the geese. Won't you take me home and give me wings to fly? We can be alone in the castle in the sky. We can run. Here's Zora. I've just finished Enzo. I jump schooled him today and he was awesome. So now I'm just about to play around with Zora. And she's all tied up and patiently waiting, as you can see. But she's generally good. She usually just stands here while I muck around with the other horses without digging. She just falls asleep. She only started digging because I'm here and she was wanting attention now. So. Just let it be for a bit while I get my stuff sorted. Time is up the answers, the blood running through our core. It's best to not feel sorry when it's over. She went really good. I legit was not expecting to have my first sit on her or even ride on her today. I wasn't even planning on backing her today. But I've never once jumped on her, leant on her. I never bounced, done that little bouncy thing you do or slapped the stirrups or stirrup leathers or anything that you do to back a horse. I just did that today and she has is going to be and has been. I haven't broken her in yet. I don't consider horses fully broken in until they 
can walk across Canter under saddle and even in like all the green growth. So yeah, but she will be by far the easiest horse I have ever and will ever break in, I think. Considering yeah, you deserve that. Considering it's her first time wearing boots, first time wearing a saddle, and her first time wearing a breastplate. So I am super proud of her. planning on breaking her in or start backing her until October but she's filled out a lot and she's got she's quite she's not like Willow she's quite uh, Willow was fine boned she's quite heavy boned so I thought yeah you know when she's ready and I found she's ready today so thank you to Gil you are so good Yay, perfect day for it too. Then obviously she'll just get tomorrow off or a couple days off. Let's pass the pie.